Bay Area native Daniel Louie was at a Seattle Starbucks roastery on a business trip when he says a Starbucks executive came up to him. I want to let you know uh, that um, we're very open with all our technology and all of our equipment. Uh, and if you want to take any of it to China, you're totally free to do that. Minutes later, he came back. You can even get same source beans, uh, but you know what you can't get in China? Uh, your tr our training. <laughs> How did you react to that? Um, I think that I was really shocked and taken aback. So we didn't know what to think. We were kind of dumbfounded. Daniel complained to Starbucks and detailed the comments in a Yelp review. This happened just before the coffee giant launched its controversial Race Together campaign to improve race relations. Starbucks apologized and added $50 to his coffee card. Then last night, a phone call from the executive himself. He actually fussed up to really thinking that we were uh, from China. Uh, and wanting to steal secrets. Apparently, the Starbucks executive thought Daniel was with a group who'd asked about copying the chain overseas. In fact, Daniel isn't even in the coffee business. He works with Christian ministries on college campuses. He accepted the apology. I want to let you know, like, that was still hurtful. Um, it was still made me uh, really uncomfortable. Um, but um, I want to extend forgiveness to you and grace. Daniel also accepted the executive's invitation to return to Seattle and talk about race and reconciliation, maybe over coffee. Sharon Chin, KPIX 5.